Hello everyone, it's always if I start, just make sure we had the right stuff before we began. Alright, we look good. This is always if I start back in the episode Mad Father. Last episode we did stuff. Now this episode. We dip our torch. Soaked with oil, we can leave this room. Oh, I need fire. Well, the only thing we have is the lamp and the torch. So, let's go cause chaos. Chaos, 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 chaos. Chaos! I got a weapon. I got fire. Time votum mortar. Time votum mortar? Huh. Yes, burn. It burns! It burns! It hurts! Help me! Toasty! Had to get something off screen. We're gonna continue on. We're in a taxidermy room already. Tools for experiments. <laughs> you already set in the bottles. Weird laughing noise. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh. Bottle of eyeballs. Thank you. Hmm. Is that it? it? Looks like it's it so far. Oh, Dad's lab. And a crow. Let's go save with the crow and see what's up. Maria? Mistress, you're wounded. Ah, uh, but I will be fine. Forget me. Escape somewhere safe. It is dangerous here. Where's father? I heard him scream from my room. That's right. I must save the doctor. Oof. You can't go on like that. But, Maria, what happened to father? The doctor is father in. His wife, she... His wife? My mom? What do you mean? Maria? Maria? My, it seems she's passed out. You again? At any rate, it sounds like your father has gone on ahead. Deeper into the underground maze. What did Maria see? Mom's passed away, right? What's going on here? Don't tell me the curse affected her, too. You'll only be able to confirm your suspicions by pressing on, won't you? Jack. What a weird guy. So she's passed out. Oh, there's something by your feet. A room key. Huh. What's going on? Father? Oh. Hi. Mom? 
Is that you, Mom? Man, wait! No way. Is that really Mom? There's no way I mistook her. That was Mom. Your Mom is... It must be the curse, right? Haven't you noticed? This tragedy was brought about by the power of a woman's curse. The mouse toward your father. Mal transformed into a curse, seeking out your father's death. Could that woman be? So you do realize, yes, your mother. That can't be right. Why do you think that? Because mom loved father. She even understood his work. And he loved her back. Wasn't mom happy? I couldn't believe she was a, she has a grudge against father. But maybe Mom didn't like Father being with Maria. I don't want it to be true, but... So you'll go find the truth. Does Mom hate Father? It can't be right. She promised. Can I go back? Yeah, there was that gem. Creepy, but almost beautiful. The moon all seems like a husk. The moon no longer. Seems like to start moving. He's sleeping. Doesn't answer. All right. Where is body? So he wants a body. Nothing there, huh? Hmm. Come here. Come here. We found it. Oh. Thanks, missus. Thank you for the gem. And good night. Door is firmly shut. Can't see, can't see, can't see anything. The man took away my eyes. Hmm, looking for her eyes. When barricade blocks away, when the barricade blocks away. Backyard shed, perfect. Charm encyclopedia. Good luck charms. You want the ones you love to be happy. For this, a good luck charm does a trick. All you need is one thing, and this you must have. It is love. Kiss someone's forehead with love and say a blessing. Then a spell of good luck we cast upon them. Isn't that wonderful? Huh. Hmm? A doll wearing strange clothes. I'll just save here. Trying to leave. Ah! Hmm. I'm gonna pack a break it. Okay. I'm trying in the barrel, which we'll take care of in a second. Cuz. a chainsaw. I remember father scolding me for playing with this once.
Aya, what are you doing with that? Sorry, Father. This is no toy. This is a very dangerous tool. Understood? Never play with anything like this again. Sorry, Father. I'm glad you're not hot. It's odd. It is odd, though. I thought I put this away somewhere that was out of your reach. Where on earth did you find this, Aya? Sorry. I'm sorry, Father. So... Got mini chainsaw. Now we can use the special button to activate it. How do we use it? By hitting sport. Well, for me, it's X on its controller. But yeah, it's actually what the C, the shift, or if you're using a controller. Don't man mumbles to himself. Curse that youngster doing everything the woman says. And so does see that does not realize her true nature. That woman's going to create a demon even crazier than the doctor. Oh, well, whatever. What should I care, I suppose? We got a flame retardant. Ladder. Hmm. Actually, you know what? Let's move this over. And a gem. Thank you. Like, can we leave here? One barricade blocks away. Nine more. Yeah, the shed replaced the attic. Where's dog? Where's dog go? Huh? Welcome back, mistress. Where's the crow? What the hell? Hmm. Oh, fun. Hmm. Can I get to that girl somehow? Not from this one. Cafeteria. <laughs> Why do I like that? Either way, I gotta find a crow. Uh, the person looks so sad. Thank you for tripping me. <laughs> and yeah, that's the last time you're laughing. Thank you. All right, get rid of that booby trap. We're getting the episode here. I hope you have fun and I'll see you on the next one. Actually, you know what? We're not gonna do it yet. We got a little bit of time. Like, just a little. Let's see if we can deliver the eyes yet. That was weird. All right. Girl was in the basement. I can hear her crying. 
wonder, is this room connected to that place? Well, get this flame retardant. Fire go out. Look inside. Aha! We got the eyeballs. Girl's crying stop. Well, that took care of that. There's one other thing we can do, but you know what? Let's go ahead and do that. If not, we'll end the episode here. In the archives, in the back. Oh, that would be the back. Hmm. Used to be the back for that room. Hmm. Well, I'll give it a shot. They moved Maria's room. Found a diary. Could this be Maria's diary? Yes. You already exed. Doctor, it's been a year to the day since you came to this mansion. I'll never forget that day. Please. Food. Give me food. Somebody. I need food. A vagrant. She could be a funny subject for some work. It's pitiful to see one so haggard. Come to my home, please. I'll give you clothes and, and delicious meals. Stay here for a little while. I'll go tell my family about you. Family? I have a wife and a daughter turning seven. I'm sure they would welcome you. Family. Uh, oh. Is this person taken in like I was? Oh, ugh. What awful injuries. He's in pain. Perhaps I could do something. My skirt won't be enough cloth. But the only other cloth, cloth I have is... This is a surprise. Coming from the brink of death, he made significant recovery overnight. It seems he was given excellent treatment. Did you treat him? Yes. How oh, handy. You're exceptionally talented. Please, I... It'd be awful to let such talent go to waste. What's your name? Huh? Uh, I... I am... Maria. Maria, huh? An appropriate name. Maria, would you be my assistant? I do not wish to lose you. Please, stay with me. 
Well, will you entrust me with the rest of your life? Yes. I was so happy. So happy you had saved me. I was alone, but you made me needed. You gave me love. As long as I am needed, I will stay with you. How would I live without you? I love you, Doctor. I never really knew anything about Maria, after all. Maria must really love Father, too. I should ask her to be my sister. Yeah, it seems Maria isn't all that bad. She did get a new room. Her room was originally in the back of the archives, but that's different. I didn't expect that to be your room. Ha ha! It was like it's just as if it were a real corpse. Perfect for it. So after that little sad moment, I'm ending the episode here. I hope you have fun. See you on the next one. See you then. Uh -oh.